Hello everyone, this is Joel from Ken Hub and welcome to another anatomy tutorial where this time we're going to be focusing on the female urinary bladder. The, now the urinary bladder is a hollow organ that serves to collect urine filtered through your kidneys. Throughout this tutorial we will focus on the structure and parts of the urinary bladder in the female pelvis. Now one important thing before we continue is that we're going to be mainly exploring this image that you now see on the screen which is essentially a coronal section of the female urinary bladder. And you see a lot of structures here which we will be highlighting to understand what's happening around the urinary bladder but this is the urinary bladder as you can see here. First structure I would like to highlight here is known as the peritoneum. Now before I go and talk about the actual bladder, I would like to just briefly mention the peritoneum and the pelvic fascia that cover part of the bladder. Now the peritoneum is a serous membrane that lines the peritoneal cavity and this membrane supports and lines the organs of the abdomen and pelvis. The next structure we're going to be highlighting here, this is known as uh, the visceral pelvic fascia. Now this is a fibrous covering over uh, the various pelvic viscera that is attached to the diaphragmatic part of the pelvic viscera. And in this illustration we see the part of the pelvic fascia that covers uh, the bladder. Also worth noting that it forms the anterior and lateral ligaments of the bladder. Let's now talk about the actual bladder, starting off with this structure that you see now highlighted in green, which is known as the body. So this is the body of the bladder. And the urinary bladder, when empty, has a pyramidal shape. It has a base, known as the fundus, an apex, a superior surface, and two inferolateral surfaces, which we will discuss later on on this tutorial. Now, the body of the urinary bladder is lined with transitional epithelium. And as you see here on this image as well, this is a hollow pear-shaped part of the urinary bladder that holds the urine before it is voided. The body is located between the fundus and the apex of the urinary bladder. The entire volume of the bladder varies, but it can hold between 400 milliliters to 1,000 milliliters. The ureters will be opening into the body of the bladder posteriorly, and you see here the orifices where they're going to be connecting uh, with the bladder, and we will talk about them later on in this tutorial. Let's continue on to the next structure that you see here highlighted in green, which is known as the fundus. Now the fundus of the urinary bladder is basically the base of the bladder. It has the shape of an inverted triangle, faces posterior inferiorly, and is formed by the posterior wall of the bladder. This video is not over yet. Continue watching now the full video at KenHub.com. We have lots more videos like this one available to our premium members on our website, not to mention all the fun quizzes, related articles, and Atlas sections. So click on the button in the middle to watch the full-length video and master anatomy.